This should be illegal. Design agencies con people every single day and it makes me really, really angry. The design agency ends up owning the rights to the new design. So rather than you owning those rights, they basically say, well, we've added something or we've actually come up with a new aesthetic or whatever, and we own some of the intellectual property around this idea. And therefore, for every one you go on to sell, you need to pay us a royalty. Now, this is a complete con. You're going to pay the design agency to do a project for you, and you're paying for that creativity and that ingenuity and for them to come up with the right product. But you shouldn't have to keep paying for that for every single unit that you make and sell. We had a client come to us last week who'd been to another design agency and she was being charged £5 per product to use the design agency's design that they had come up with. So basically, every time she produced and manufactured a product, she was having to add £5 on to pay the design firm. But the thing is, she paid the design firm fees to design the project in the first place. They had this hidden secret clause within the contract that basically meant that they could charge her for rights to use the design on every product that she went on to manufacture and sell. And it's only when she started questioning the manufacturer and saying, why is this product so expensive? We've got to get it cheaper. I can't you know, sell it without getting the product cost down because I'm not, there's just not enough margin in it. It's only then that she understood from the factory that there was this design referral fee that no one had told her about. And that basically was making her product far too expensive and she couldn't make any profit out of it. Now this should be illegal. It isn't illegal yet. You can make sure that you don't fall into this trap by making sure that within the contract with the product design firm that all the intellectual property, including on anything new that they bring to your design while working for you, belongs to you. You can make doubly certain of this by getting that design company to sign an IP assignment agreement at the end of the project that makes it explicitly clear that they're transferring all of the IP rights in the project. And this is critical for investment, but before I explain why, please do make sure you hit the like, hit the subscribe button, and if you've got any questions on this video, please do put them in the comments section below. This is really helpful to help grow the channel. Now this is critical for investment because the thing is, a lot of investors will do due diligence before they put any money into your product. And investors, one of the things they check for is that all the intellectual property is retained by the company they're investing in. And if they find that a designer's still got some IP around your product or some rights to it, or maybe your photographer's still got some IP rights to the photos that have been taken of your product, then that's a big red flag for investors. You want to make sure that all of the IP is within your business. I hope that's helped. Please do check out the next video.